What's up guys? Welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing this makeup look right here that I'm so obsessed with. I'm obsessed with Hot Fire. Obviously from the Desi Katie Dose of Colors collection. Um, and then I also have their eyeshadow quad on my eyes as well. Um, but yeah, I'm so, so obsessed with Hot Fire. It's gorgeous. I mean, some, it's not like everyone's color, but my all-time favorite lip color in the world as of the day I got it. <laughs> so yeah, I will be creating this look for you guys, and if you guys want to see how I got this look, stay tuned. But before, please don't forget to uh, subscribe down below, and at the end, if you like it, give it a thumbs up. Okay, let's go. Alright guys, so I already put on my foundation. I went in with the CoverGirl Healthy Elixir in 732, an LA Girl HD High Definition Longwear Illuminating Foundation in natural, and I mix these two. It's like my perfect combo right now. And then I went in with Chart. <laughs> oh my gosh. Tart Shape Tape. <laughs> Okay, went in with Tarte Shape Tape in light medium, and then I set it with the Fit Me Loose Finishing Powder in light medium 20, and then contoured with LA Girl Pro Concealer in Chestnut, and then went over that with Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette. So let's get into the eyes. I really, I just did that before filming because I want to focus on the Dose of Colors makeup. So we're going to get into the eyes. Okay, so I'm going to start off with the Morphe M441 brush, and then I'm going to take the Morphe 350 palette, and that's what I'm going to be using to do my transition shades since the eyeshadow palette is just all dramatic shades, which I'm sure you all know. We're going to be just creating the transition. Guys, hot fire. I wore it the other day. Oh my gosh. It is insane. Insanely gorgeous. I love it. I have another palette. I have the Morphe 35F in front of me as well. So let's see. Yeah, there's like this pretty shade I want to go in with. This is the Real Techniques number 203 brush. Just focusing not on... Fo Why can't I speak today? I'm just focusing this shade on my outer corner. This brush is actually like heavy. It's really heavy. I'm just really trying to deepen this outer V so that I can put on, what are these two shades? Suze and Noli. Okay, so let's, where's my little instructions? Okay, so Noli says, bring out your inner bombshell with this sultry bronze hue. This perfect bronze shade is a, power, is a powerfully pigmented formula that glides onto the lids for a silky smooth finish. Okay, so that one I don't have to use wet. Okay, so I just dip my finger into Noli. I keep getting confused. I wanna focus Noli more in the middle. And then I'm gonna pick up Sue's. It says to use it wet, so using the condensation for my Starbucks cup. Oh wow, that one had a lot of fallout. But I'm gonna put that in my inner corner right here. Oh shoot, this one has a lot of fallout. Okay. 
Ooh. This one's really, really pretty. Okay. I'm going... There's just a lot of fallout. Ay ay ay. Ay ay ay. really falling out oh no it won't come off my face oh damn okay I have a lot a lot a lot on this finger so I'm gonna try and pack it on damn every time I pack it on though it falls off so I'm going, let's see what I'm going to do. I'm going to pack on more of Noli. <laughs> In the middle, Sue's kind of took over. Okay, I'm going to leave it like that. Let me try and deepen it a little more damn guys there's kind of a lot of fallout I'm, I'm bummed I used harpoon in my last video and there was no fallout like at all all right let's do the other eye Mm, let me just darken it a little bit. Okay. Same thing, going in with Noli. And then just taking the rest. I haven't dipped my finger back into Sue's yet. I'm bummed that it has so much fallout. I literally have Sue's all the way down my face. Oh. Look at how much more this one applies like how much more vibrant this one is than this one. This one has, um, is wet, so I need to wet that side again. Damn, super pretty, okay. Let me wet my brush a little bit and get some of Sue's. And pack it on. It's hard to get it in like the crease or in like. The very, very, like the inner corner of your eye. Okay, so I think I'm super satisfied with that. Okay, so our eyes are done. Let's do blush. I'm going to go in with Warm Soul from MAC. This is my all-time favorite blush in like the entire world. Love it. Perfect for summertime too. Okie doke. What is next? You guys, I'm like loving these eyes right now. Okay. I really wish I had Fuego to go in with. I don't think I want to go in with Mirame because it's too pinky for this look. Let me see what I have. Ooh. Okay, so for highlighter, I'm going to mix 
Maybelline Master Chrome and Jaclyn Hill Champagne Pop. I have not used Champagne Pop in a long time. That used to be like my go-to. I'm just gonna leave it with champagne pop because the eyes are so crazy. I don't want it to be super, super crazy um, and take away from the eyes. So we're gonna leave it with champagne pop. I really like how that looks. Um, next, let's go into the under eyes. We are going to take MAC 219 brush and the same shades I used on my outer corner, take it into my, my under eye. Okay, perfect. Just connecting it to the eyeshadow on the bottom. Okay, so we're going to take this Pop Beauty eyeliner. This is in the color Sooty Black, and I'm going to put it in my waterline. This is really, really sharp. Oh my gosh. I need to like... That was super uncomfortable. It hurt. It's never hurt like that. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and put mascara and my eyelashes on off camera because it takes me like 30 minutes, not even lying, and then I'll come back on camera. Okay. I'm still trying to figure out if I like these lashes or not. I kind of liked the makeup look without these lashes, but I don't know. I don't want to take them off because then, I don't know. <laughs> I feel like just because I don't wear them all, all the time, like lashes, rarely I wear them. So maybe that's why I'm just like, these are so crazy to me. They're pretty though. I don't know. Anyway, we're gonna go ahead and do the star of the show, Miss Hotfire right here. Okay, let's, I'm gonna line my lips because I don't have anything close to that color. This is the closest I can get. It is the LA Girl, okay, it's the Intense Day Auto Liner Forever Bare. <laughs> Okay, so now, hot fire. I'm so excited. You can run free, I won't hold it against you. You do your thing, never wanted a future. Wow. See, I told you guys, it's literally hot fire. I'm gonna put some, oh, highlight on my nose. I'm actually going to put me down my on my nose. Forgot that this has a little bit of Noli on it. From my eyeshadow. Mm. I'll leave the lips. Okay, I'm still like debating about these eyelashes. I don't know. I really, really don't know. Oh, I don't know. I'm just gonna leave them on because if I take them off and they look bad, I'm gonna be mad. But I don't know. Just know, I don't know about them yet. <laughs> oh, and they are the Red Cherry Lashes in Molly. They're really pretty. I just think I'm not used to them because I never wear lashes. I have really long lashes already. Um, but yeah, okay, let me do my hair and then I'll come back on camera to finish this video. All right guys, so I finished doing my hair. I just straightened it and that is gonna complete the video. This is probably my favorite look just honestly because of Hot Fire. I'm obsessed. I can't even tell you how obsessed I am with Hot Fire. It's gorgeous. My favorite, it's my favorite lip product of all time. Not even lying. I love those bright, bright, like, oh. I just love it. I can't even put into words how much I love it. If you get anything anything from the collection, get Hot Fire. 
it is exactly the name hot fire it's so freaking pretty um but i do love everything i'm just saying if you could only get one thing if you like limit yourself to one thing get this um i hope you enjoyed as much as i did i'm obsessed with this look and if you did if you love it give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe down below and i will see you on friday with a new video bye guys